Hello everyone, welcome to Connexi training videos. Today in this video, like I have to tell you about the latest chat GPT release. So where you can train your own GPT. So basically based on uh, your uh, thing, like you can actually build your own libraries uh, by training the GPT, like, and, you know, like uh, perform a couple of actions, like basically you can train GPT to you know answer your user questions based on your businesses or perform some actions uh, based on your businesses so make use of uh, this uh, gpt uh, train your own gpt and perform those actions so let me show you how to do that so we are fortunate enough one of the fortunate enough to get the early access of chat gpt so there is an options over here they had given as explore so all our latest uh, you know chats will be present uh, over here and when you click on explore so it will going to show you all the gpt's which you train and also uh, you know like you can create your own gpt and couple of gpt's has been uh, made by openai like this dolly and couple of other gpt's they are created over here so similarly you can create uh, your own uh, gpt so to perform those actions like how dolly will actually generate an image so you can create your own gpt to perform an actions for example you can create uh, something like you know remove the background of a picture when somebody uploads an image so you can do that perform those actions using your own applications for example you can use connects it and other background remover and you can upload the image from the chat gpt and you can remove and you can give back that image so in this uh, particular gpt strange uh, gpt's what you are doing and also the one good thing is you can make this to available for your community basically uh, you know like uh, uh, those who have that link or you can also uh, make it as a public so everyone will going to access uh, your trained gpt so let us start to train uh, our new gpt so i'll just try to build and you know connect it support care where whenever somebody asks uh, questions and it will going to reply based on the knowledge base uh, which we are sharing so very simple gpt i am going to try so i'll say as respond document so we have this documents also will be uploaded i'll show you how to do that so just send a message to gpt builder it will going to build uh, the gpt so it will going to update the gpt so all the actions which will be performed on the left hand side you can see it on the right hand side so how the gpt will going to be trained so it says like great let's give uh, the gpt name that fits to how about connects it uh, key so basically you can say yes or you can just say like hello let it be so something like this so it will going to name uh, your gpt so you can preview all those things over here so it is updating the gpt now and also it has given all the questions over here so most frequently asked uh, questions so you can see that all these things you can actually modify so it has given me uh, basically the uh, icon as well so it auto generated the out, uh, icon so we can go to configure and we can configure all these things for example i am going to upload uh, my own uh, picture over here like connects it uh, support so for this i'm going to upload a connect it logo and if you want to keep the name as automation key like you can do that or you can even change it over here and instructions and basically these are the questions which will appear over here so that is uh, first questions 
so basically you can even change those questions as well and upload the file so basically i had created an faq document uh, so i'll just show you that a document looks like this so very simple a uh, couple of questions uh, which we had uh, on faq so i just created a document and i'm uploading the same over here so it has been uploaded even you can upload pdf file or uh, you know like images uh, based on these things so it will automatically uh, do perform the actions and not only this so this is where i wanted to show you uh, uh, you know all uh, the options where you can add actions so these are the api uh, actions so basically you can perform uh, this using the api key and uh, the uh, api question so basically here uh, is something you can perform uh, so chat gpt as an capability to generate the content so as an intelligent system but to do couple of work you need to use uh, a tools uh, for example you know removing the background so those kind of things are like you know uh performing some action booking an appointment uh, with uh, some tool so all those things you have to use external services so for this like connect it an automation tool will be most helpful i am going to show you how to do that step by step in my future videos so at this moment so we just uh, leave it like that so just i wanted to show you a basic use case so basically you can use this api actions to perform the actions over here and uh, couple of additional uh, settings so you can do this so this is how you can configure your uh, gpt so now let's go back here and just type yes so it will going to update so we can even update all these things so it is generating the profile picture again So it's like this, like it has updated me the profile pic. Uh, I said okay. So even we can change it over here. Go back and change it the profile pic. So now it says like will interact with the user. What topics should be empathized or avoided uh, when providing support? Uh, so if you want to give details, so you can do those things. At this moment, I will just leave like this and going to save it. So when I try to save. So it will ask me whether I need to make public or uh, you know like I can uh, view only for me or like you know this is for the community so only people with a link so I can do that so I will go ahead and confirm so those who have that particular link so they can actually uh, use my uh, support so now I will go ahead go and ask a couple of questions uh, to uh, chat gpt so like i'll just ask related to my business so i'll just go ahead and type so now this will going to help uh, even the gpt uh, team as well they have made a wonderful work where you know it will not going to hit their server again and again based on the document so it's going to be uh, saving a lot of uh, uh, users as well for them so just when i hit so it is taking the question and it will search for that inside my uh, document so you can see this is the same answer which i provided over here so basically so this will going to give me the answers uh, like this i mean this is kind of example i'm giving so there are a lot of things uh, you can do it you can try in your own gpt and uh, you can make use uh, for your business so i'm just going to ask one more question so this is how uh, basically you can use uh, a new model of uh, chat gpt and train your own gpt and perform the actions hope you guys like this uh, complete uh, setup and if you have any questions on this setup so do drop me on the comment section below keep automating guys